Hi Leo, welcome to my channel Leo. I hope you are doing well. I hope you're finding safe and doing good. This reading for today, this is for the Leo sign. Thank you so much Leo for supporting the channel. Thank you so much Leo for being here. Let us see what is coming towards you Leo. What is the guided message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know? This is for the Leo sign, please. Let's look into your focus. Let's look into your situation. What is coming towards Leo, please? In love, career, money, and general situationship, okay? This is an open message for the Leo sign. I want you to think of your situation. I want you to think of your focus. I want you to think of your person, if it's a person. I'll tap into your energy. Ooh, you have a lover's card and the hangman. And let's see what's coming towards you, okay? What's the guided message for the Leo sign? Think about your focus. Think about your situation. Think about your person, if it's a person. I'll tap into your energy. Let's see what's coming towards you. What can I get for the Leo sign? What is the guided message for you guys, okay? What can I get for the Leo sign? I'm just checking the camera. Let's look into your overall energy and then the second part of the reading. Let's see what's coming towards you. What's your guided message? This is an open reading for the Leo sign. The Four of Wands. <coughs> the Five of Pentacles. Okay. Alright, Leo, let's start your reading. So you're starting the reading with the Tower card, the Ten of Pentacles, and the Nine of Wands. In terms of situation, focus, and... <coughs> overall energy leo you could be dealing with a breakup or something heartbreaking okay there is some sort of remnants you know i'm, I'm really picking up the vibe that there's a residual of a breakup or how or, or excuse me <clears throat> like there's a residual of a heartbreak okay there, there is there's some sort of um it marked okay there is a mark in your heart leo and it's connected to a heartbreak it's connected to a breakup it's connected to something that if given a chance you don't want to repeat it you know because the tower card is next to the ten of pentacles so you could be dealing from moving on from a heavy heartbreak from a heartbreak from a collapse okay because tower card this is something unexpected this is disruption and it's next to the ten of pentacles so it really destabilize your <clears throat> it has destabilized your life it has destabilized your finances it's you know if it's not that big it could be it has a huge impact in your finances in your day-to-day -day, or something practical also it's connected to your overall well-being okay the tower card the ten of pentacles this is a disruption of some kind and you're dealing with it you're processing it because you know this is one of your focus is to get your money back to get your stability back to get on to move on it's you're pulling all of your resources and your strength leo to move ahead from this disruption because your overall overall energy gets the nine of wands so this is you you know it's giving me this vibe that you're fighting for your life you're fighting every day to get things done to recover to recuperate it is something to do with a life stability you know this is you it's like every day every day you wake up and you fight you know like the nine of wands okay every every waking day when when this took place it could still be happening right now or you could be having some sort of effect yeah the judgment card wow because the judgment card this is something inevitable okay this is something whatever this one is leo this is heavy unexpected inevitable it's a big heartbreak it's it's a heartache it is something that you've been moving on you're countering it you're fighting every waking day of your life you fight to survive you fight to move on you fight to forget it you fight to get on with your life and be stable again because your focus is to get to the 10 
your focus is not just to move on to surpass it you know to exceed it okay so you have a big goal not just to move on from the pain but to come out miraculously victoriously and the reason why oh, see the six of swords and the reason why i'm saying that is because <clears throat> there's a lion and you're holding the wands this is you every waking day is like an adventure you fight you work you're inspired it's quite a life leo you know but i could feel even though it's difficult there's joy in your heart and strength and braveness that whatever took place in here i will survive i have survived i will exceed so you're not just a believer you're a fighter and a lover of life definitely with the with the lion and the nine of wands you're guarding your life you're guarding your destiny you're lifting your finances you're lifting your up <clears throat> you know you're lifting yourself from i don't know maybe poverty from heartache from heartbreak from something that collapsed and the number one person that cheers you up is you your ego your ego your reputation like your ego some your your ego is positive in here in the sense that you're reminding yourself that this breakdown is actually going to lead to your breakthrough and i believe you you're very brave look at that eight of cups you're su you're switching off emotions like this is a reading where you're switching off your emotions and you're grinding you know it's like okay at night i cry but tomorrow i wake up with a new sun with a new day and i fight i fight to survive i exceed my day you know look at that the center of the reading and the sun card this is where this is your focus this is where you're heading you know this is where he this is where you're going is to one day be so strong that you will feel your back with your queen of wands like you're finding your mojo you're finding back you're 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 you're, you're finding way to to be on track you know because i feel like there is a bit of delay in here i would say this heartbreak or this challenge or this problem it has affected you mentally emotionally spiritually but you've gone through at least half oh my gosh i have a wound sorry so i would say you're almost there or you're half through or i would say you're out of the woods okay this is a reading where nine of wands i'm out of the woods i have you know you're out of the woods this is the time where i you want to get back on track now you want to solidify where you're like where you stand you know it's like i have survived okay this is a reading where i have survived now i want to be better <clears throat> now i don't want to just survive i want to come out big after this so that's why you're bring it on like sun, sun you know like the sun the queen of wands like bring it on okay i want to be stronger after this the aftermath of this breakup this heartbreak this disaster i have survived it now i need to be better if i have so if i have survived this then i'm brave then bring it on this is where this is where you you go through your breakthrough the sun card the queen of wands you're very positive you're very optimistic and you're very hard working you're very hard working i'm really picking up the vibe you wake up you work no complain you wake up you work no complain you know ace of wands you're finding the light every day you find the light every day every waking day you look into the sun you're grateful because your pain is your power you're about to get your breakthrough leo would say yeah you're different now okay you can feel in your core that you're a different person after this you're definitely stronger than the version of the leo in the past and you're using the new version to really tap into your full potential yeah page of pentacles and i could feel that you're very proactive or you're very proactive or this could be something it could be the advice to you it could be the 
it could be your higher self the universe is really enc encouraging you you've survived you're out of the woods you're getting better you're getting more and more stronger your your depth your your braveness your brave heart is so deep it's connected to your soul to your core with the page of pentacles and the ace of wands in here it looks like for some of you you're kind of being advised by by your higher self to be proactive if you got some ideas if you got some some stuff to do don't wait for tomorrow why do it why not like you're being asked ace of wands page of pentacles do it now why would you wait for tomorrow if you can do it now okay so for some of you there is a mindset improvement transition like your past is meeting up the new version of yourself and you're transforming in such a way that your work relationship your communication skills your mojo your style your personality your style it's going to change it's practical and magical it means that you wouldn't wait for tomorrow you're going to do it now like there's a part of you that you know if i can do it now and be productive i'll do it now i'm not going to wait for tomorrow you value time more than ever after this disaster you value time more than ever and with the will of fortune oh my gosh this is a promise to yourself you're promising yourself that you're going to deliver the life that you deserve the life that you want like this is like a bring it on moment leo you you are alive yeah knight of cups for some of you you have an incoming so as you tap into inspiration as you tap into as you feel you're out of the woods you feel safe okay you're safe you feel safe you're out of the woods you're really getting back into more i'm really picking up i want more and if i want more i'm willing to work hard and i'm not just gonna wait here i'm gonna be proactive i'm gonna follow up and not only that but you're very optimistic you wouldn't say no for an answer as well leo you wouldn't say no for an answer with the four of wands and the five of cups you know with the with the four of wands and the five of pentacles in here you wouldn't say no for an answer it means that if you get a no you'll even go to the competition and get some stuff in there so it's like every time you get a no it's a redirection towards you so you're not stopping because five of pentacles and the four of wands no one is going to hold you back where you're going aspirations goals whether it's personal or professional this is something that we cannot hold you back anymore you're you're sitting in a vibe where you're unstoppable and you have an inspiration so in the process of increasing your finances in the process of increasing your social media exposure in the process in in working out with you know exploring what's next for me i'm ready bring it on you have an inspiration a knight of cups this is what's coming towards you um there's a knight of cups and it's connected online and it's someone who would direct you to your next project direct you to your next inspiration or it could be the source of your inf inspiration it's someone that you would come across online it's someone that you and them will communicate a lot online it's giving me a real time someone is stepping forward in your busy day someone is going to come in and bring you inspiration it could be an actual person connected to a project or it could be a person of inspiration a person of romantic interest okay but you have it like the universe is going to send you an inspiration while you keep yourself busy with what's next whatever you're working on whatever your focus is it's getting and getting noisier like you're gonna get lots of replies respond like it, it's gonna be busy like you're gonna enter a cycle where it's busy and it's good busy because it's productive and it's gonna get you money it's gonna get you abundance your social media invites it's gonna increase too and this is probably why i'm picking up that this person it's gonna give you some sort of inf inspiration or abundance okay so keep going you know keep moving leo you're out of the woods all right this is what i have for leo thank you so much for supporting the channel thank you so much for being here i will see you soon again guys you have a great day bye bye